Boop! Hello everybody, my name is Game of Plate. welcome back to an episode of The Walking Dead. Now, last we left off, we uh, were on uh, episode 2, as we know before, and we were heading off to the dairy farm because we shared, well, we decided to get some gas. So that's where we left off, and we're going to jump right on in. Oh, whoop. Do, 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 do. All right, so if you guys are liking this series, uh, I kind of want to know some feedback as we're sitting here on the loading screen and my face is slowly not connecting with my lips. All right, now we're in. Here we are. Just gonna just skedaddling on over to the farm. We got our hunting rifle here somehow here. strung on our back. St. John Family Dairy. Yep. A beautiful place it is. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. At least you know what's on, right? <laughs> 4,000 boats through that thing with generators Dang. and amps. That ain't safe, I'm man. I'm going to assume that's a lot. That'll fry anybody. It'll cook their brain, but I don't really understand how they could stop. Hello, ma'am. This is a brilliant this setup, though. This is a really brilliant setup. It really is. just fine. This place looks untouched. You'd never know the rest of the world is in ruins. No, we would it's not. It's worth protecting. Hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, Hi, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. Oh, boy, they so everybody knows good. about me, then. Yeehaw. We got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh, my goodness. That place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? Lily keeps us focused on survival. He's tough as nails and keeps us focused on what it takes to survive. Lily was in the military, like me. Well, that's that, ex that explains that her dad was too. That the safest place. Now that y'all are here, we'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We bought gas. Well, we brought, we brought some, brought some gasoline, gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. These yeah, are that, for that's y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. For us. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's mm, right. It's going to be so Hopefully good. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Let's hope so. Let's hope Your she's zombified. What's she? We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered. I'm gonna assume this cat. Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend, and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. That sounds. It'd be nice really to have some good idea, to help actually. out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? I don't know who Danny is, why but he looks I like their son. The so. And round up everyone for the trip over here. Might want to take someone with you. Remember. Those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Yeah, you don't this. go. Yeah, you take Why don't you go ahead you. and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. What is, what's she putting it on her back with? There's no strap that goes across. Like Mark Lee, uh, don't why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. I will learn gladly. a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. Yeah, that's you a deal. Betcha. This place is incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? We should do whatever we can. Food. We should do whatever we can to make these people like us. The way Brenda was talking, I get the feeling like she'd be happy to have us stay. All the more reason for us not to fuck this up. If Andy needs well, you want to help him, you want to be very kind, generous people here. Do. So we're gonna we're gonna do what they ask. Like, hey, can you help us out? Of course, we'll help you out. We'll just do it out of good because we're nice people. What do we got over here? Well, I'll just click instead of use my WASD keys. Okay, so we got our axe hidden somewhere. Too bad it's broken. 
I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. How'd it break? break? Got busted the first day those things showed up. Thank God no one was on it at the time. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Yeah, right. Well, we'll fix her on up. What do we got? We're going to walk meander over this way. We'll see. Oh, what's this? That's oh, a light. That ain't a clicker, do. I don't know where I was going. We were gonna take a look around the fence. That was weird. All right, this way, this way, Mr. Lee. Checking the perimeter. Hey, uh, what are you fixing to do around the barn? I didn't know. Just that. trying to find more ways to help out. Well, I appreciate that. Tell you what, we'll find you something to do over there after we get back from securing the perimeter. Sounds good. I didn't realize that was a gate. Man, this fence is fantastic. We'll do whatever you want to help keep it running. Well, clearing that perimeter is going to be a big help. Just let me know when you're ready. Well, we're just gonna take uh Could be useful if I can find some boards to cut. Hey, we found a board to cut. Would you look Mind at that? I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. Now all we need is some rope. Roper Joper. Let's see electric fence. We'll just head on over there and we'll put this board all up to good use. You know, unless we need new rope, we might be able to get away without getting new rope, I think. We'll see. The board is good, but I need some rope. Yeah, I knew it. I done knew it. Okay, let's head on inside because the barn is seeming to be off the of limits here. So we're going to head on inside. Oh, I don't know what's hanging up over there. Well, hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Alrighty. Your family's done an amazing job of keeping this place up. Well, now aren't you sweet? Thank you, Lee. The boys and I have tried to adapt as best we can, but we keep in the good old farm stuff. Routine, yep, the same old routine. Routines. Well, if anything comes up that I can help with, feel free to let me know. Well, we'll Lee, help I out. sure appreciate it. No problem. What do we have hanging up over here? Take a gander. This dairy won a lot of ribbons in its day, huh? This place was my daddy's life. Meant everything to him. You know, when uh -huh. he first bought this place, it was a single-story house. Is that right? After us kids was born, he insisted on adding a second floor. Said they had to have room for as many babies as they could have. <laughs> Mama, she was done after Dan. <laughs> my folks stopped after two as well. Then one day, the world changed. Now this place is all we have left of daddy. That's why we take such good oh, care of it. That, that, that why makes we a lot of sense. want to share it with good folks like yourselves. They want to keep it going. I respect that. I respect these guys right here. I really like them. Okay, those are just plants. We don't need to look at them. Okay, let's head on into the barn because I don't see any rope hanging around, so... I 
Why are we looking at the fence? Before I head on over here, we'll take a look at the fence. Hmm. Oui. Well, uh, that seems... I can't... can't get my mouse... Oh, there we go. Take a gander at her. What's that? Generator. <laughs> you guys come along with gas just in time. It's pretty quiet for a generator, hey, to be totally uh, honest. Don't mess with that, okay? The thing's a little tricky, and I don't want to spend half a day trying to fix it again. All right, we won't touch your shit. Understood. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. Pretty I noticed back fine. at the That's motel that you folks are pretty well armed. You've been stockpiling, huh? Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll never come to that, but thanks. I have a feeling it will. Okay. Before she gets to the car, she's back.